everybody. I'm back in the building. It's Dr. CI. And today I'm going to be talking to you about the difference between equity and equality. Now you've seen the title of this video, which is to hell with equality, but let me make some sense of that so y'all understand what it is that we're actually saying at Inclusology. So there's a difference between equality and equity. Often you hear people say, well, we just want everybody to be treated equal. Okay, I get that. You got good intentions, but stop saying that shit. And here's why. Equality is about sameness. Equity is about fairness. Equality is the outcome. Equity is the action. So see, yes, we want everybody to feel like they're being treated equal, okay? But in order to get to a place of feeling equal, you gotta treat people fairly. So for example, here's one of the simplest examples I can give you. Think about the fact that you work in the building. You're able-bodied. You can walk into that building. You can walk on an elevator. You could probably walk up the stairs if you needed to in some way, shape, or form, depending on where you are physically. But if I'm in a wheelchair and all you have is stairs, I'm unable to access your building without an issue, right? It's going to take some extra effort to get me up those stairs. So what, what do we do? We have the ADA, which requires you to put things like a ramp in your building, okay? And ADA is the American with Disabilities Act. That creates, that is equity, that creates equality. Because what happens is if I'm in that wheelchair and I use that ramp to get into the building, I have, this, I have the same amount of access as you to be able to get to work and when I get on that elevator. See, that's equality. Because you were equitable enough to put a ramp in the building, the outcome is equal. But if you go in and try to treat everybody equally, you're going to run into a lot of fucking problems. And part of the reason why is because people who are often able-bodied don't think about the fact that people need accommodations because you've never had to have them. And that doesn't make you a bad person for the fact that you've never had to have accommodations. But what might make you a bad person is if you refuse to accommodate somebody else because you think it's going to hurt your privilege. Do y'all understand? Y'all understand the words that are coming out of my mouth? So think about the fact when you say, we just want everybody to be treated equal. No, you don't. You say, we want everybody to be treated equitable so we can all feel equal. Okay? Because equality, sameness is about people feeling like they're respected, accepted, etc. So think about the difference again between equity and equality. Fairness versus sameness. Now, one is the action, one is the outcome. Y'all get that? Y'all got it? Good. All right, I'm Dr. C.I. Don't forget to go into the comments and tell me about the difference between equity and equality for you and when you've had to take those actions in order to reach that outcome. I'm looking forward to hearing your examples. Like and subscribe to the channel. Don't forget to turn on that bell and notifications pop up. And we'll see y'all soon. Y'all have a blessed day.